Let's go. Our cheater from the other video has been banned. That's awesome. Welcome, guys, to another episode of Low Star Series, How to Get Better at Bed Wars, whatever you want to call it. Um, today, we're going to be talking about emeralds, probably the most versatile resources in the game. And emeralds are super important because they allow you to clutch. They allow you to beat people who are better at the game than you. And they're just super useful and super fun to use. So we're going to jump into a game and get right to that okay we're on a game and here in lightstone um i'm gonna do my traditional rush the opponent before they get a chance to gather their bearings and uh, once we take them out we'll be able to go to mid and get to use some emeralds okay see you guy bye super fun let's go to mid super fast um we're gonna worry about the diamonds a little bit later actually it's gonna take a while for the ems to spawn at mid anyway so let's click diamonds Oh, we fell. Uh, Gray might be hacking. Uh, I just saw that, and I am not comfortable with what I saw. Let's report him just in case. Okay, he got pink bed. What we're gonna do is we're gonna grab the diamonds so that more can spawn, but we're gonna take him back to our base later because we need to get these emeralds before anyone else does. Um, I did not like the bridge that Gray was making. It looks a little suspicious if you ask me. Um, okay, green is almost to mid, although he didn't take out yellow, so I'm questioning his thought process on that. Let's just let him run around. Okay, we grab this diamond, grab these. Okay, we have eight emeralds, which is usually what you can get if you grab emeralds at the beginning of the game. We're going to buy a sharp mining fatigue. One of the things I'm going to buy is jump boost, bridge egg, and invisibility. Now, the reason I buy these particular, uh, these particular resources is because um, they can be super versatile in trying to rush your opponents and I'll show you what I mean um, if we can just so much as make it to Gray's diamond gen then we can rush straight to his base with his bridge egg this is one of my favorite combos okay I didn't realize that Gray had disconnected but this is one of my favorite combinations of getting emeralds um, if we just grab some uh, potions here we can bridge straight over before he gets a chance to Realize what hit him, although I think he might have might have left the game. So that was kind of a waste. But he's gone. And we can get brought in a trap. If you feel like you're bad at bridging, bridge eggs are a totally viable way to get to people's bases. Especially um, when there's not a bridge and because there's nothing they can do to stop you. Another thing I like to do is to get jump and speed. Um, that can really help when you're trying to rush people because if you're fighting somebody and you have speed, they won't be able to outrun you. Or in other words, um, you'll always be able to catch up to them and always kill them, and it's pretty awesome. Aqua just took out White. I'm not sure if he has a bridge over here yet. He does not. So a bridge egg would have been really useful in this scenario, um, but we don't have that, so we're just going to bridge normally over to White base. And wait. Oh, it was Aqua who's still alive. I see. I see. I am silly. Bought some jump boost on this guy. Woo. He almost fell. I didn't realize they bridged so high. Okay, nobody's rushing us so far, which is good. Um, grab a golden apple. We can take out Aqua here. Ooh, a little bit laggy, but that's all right. Oh, shoot. I forgot that I had speed. And uh, speed bridging is a totally different monster when, when you have speed potions. Um, next game, I'll show you some of the other items that I like to buy. But speed and jump and invis are super useful and can be used by people of all skill levels, so. Okay. Oh, he's got a diamond sword! Oh my gosh. Well, diamond armor and a diamond sword are things you can also buy with emeralds, but I don't like that. Okay. Got a whole heck of a lot of endstone. Stay back. Oh my gosh. Nope. Yeah, no, nice try. Nice try, buddy. We won that game. <laughs> okay, here we are in the next game. We're going to rush our opponent. we got to remember that we want to go to mid so we can showcase some of these emeralds. Nice. All right. All good in that department. Okay, let's rush blue real fast. No blue. Come back here. 
Oh, no. No. Oh. Okay, red's probably going to get to that final now. All right. Um, let's just do a bit of that. Oh, wow, that was close. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my gosh. He's got so many fireballs. How many more do you have, huh? Woo! No. Oh, we got four, six emeralds. That's awesome. Is that enough to do something here? I think so. So, bridge eggs, great. Speed, jump in viz are, are all awesome. Um, you could buy a punch bow, but I don't think I'll showcase that because that is very scummy. Um, he's almost here. You know what? Let's do it. Let's buy a punch bow. Buying a punch bow is probably the worst thing you can do as a human being, but we're going to do it anyway. See how this guy reacts. Oh my. Well, he got a diamond sword, so that serves him right. Exactly. Punch out. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what we did. Um, another thing that can be really good is uh, whoops, having jump boost to go with it because it'll make it harder for people to, um, you know, fireball you off or hit you or whatever. I still have a punch bow, by the way. Even though you died, I didn't. Sorry, buddy. Oh, man. Poor kid. <laughs> oh, that's so bad. All right, so in this game, we're going to try and stack up on some diamonds, but not in the way you might think I'm talking about. You think, oh, we're going to get protection and sharpness. Well, yes, we will get that. But we're going to get diamond armor and a diamond sword. Um, that way, if people try to fight us, they're sure to lose. Oh, boy. Oh, my. This guy's so high. Not, uh, not on drugs, but... Oh, we just fell off as well. Whoa! Okay, we got him, we got him, we got him. And now we're gonna deposit everything we have, because... On Lightstone, everything is valuable. <laughs> including the stone sword, because the gens are so slow. Alright, we literally stole everything from him, so... We can get armor... And some of that. That's... That's good. That's rich. Oh, he, he disconnected. Okay. We're going to get diamonds, but super fast. Because we need to make a priority. Actually, you know what? We could just go to mid. It does seem like somebody else, like yellow or somebody else has been to mid already. Oh, or aqua. This could be bad. Oh, we just bought iron armor. And I forgot that I was intending to buy diamond armor. Well, if you already have iron armor, you probably don't need diamond armor, for being honest. Um, it's not going to give you that much more of an advantage. Okay, we're going to get ourselves diamond armor. Oops. And a diamond sword. Geared up! <laughs> That's funny, I didn't realize that was an achievement. I think it would be helpful to get protection as well, because if you just have diamond armor, it's only half a prot better, so to speak, than, um, than iron armor. If we're running around the whole game with diamond armor and diamond sword, then people are sure to think us noobs, because people don't actually do this in the game. We want to use our bridge egg. Yes, we do. Sorry, buddy. Oh, he didn't even touch us. Um, who's left? It's just yellow and us. I see him here. Oh, wait. He's gonna run low mid. We might be able to cut him off, honestly. Oh, jeez. This guy's also stacked. Holy cow. I think I'm gonna put away our diamond sword just in case um, he manages to kill us. That could be really bad. Actually, you know what we can do? Let's get prot. Three. He's running towards our base. Yeah, he's almost to our base. Okay. I'll tell you what. We don't have a good enough defense for him to... Or for us to save it. So we're gonna get this over here. Now we have prot three and diamond armor. So you know what? We're right here. Oh, that was a bad idea. What is he doing? Oh my goodness. Did he just jump? Oh, he's running. He's running for it. How dare you? Where 
we're actually low. Yeah, no. Whoa, this game was ours. Nice try. He's toxic. You're so bad. Same. That was so funny. Yes. Okay, this will probably be our last game, because I'm going to showcase one more item that I really like out of the Bed Wars shop, and that is the Ender Pearl. Ender Pearls are super, super versatile, uh, because you can use them to rush people, to clutch, basically to get around the map in different ways, and it's so, so good. All right. Hey, buddy. Oh my. Yeah, you can jump off, that's fine. We're going to rush yellow first before anything else. Um, just because I'm so, so hungry for finals right now. Whoa! Oh my gosh, okay, we got a hacker right there. Holy frick, that is not cool. Uh, this is really bad. I think we're gonna have to ditch bed. Uh-oh. Oh! Wait! We destroyed him! He's so bad at the game! He's so bad! Oh my gosh! That is so good, dude. I- Oh, I'm so high on- I'm so in such a euphoric state right now, which I know is really nerdy for me to say, but- Oh! That felt so good. Oh, we outplayed a cheater. Again, like every video now. <laughs> okay, well, the next thing we're gonna do is grab emeralds. He's also got an iron sword. I'm not sure if I like that. You're not cheating too, are you? Okay, he's not cheating, good. Okay, we should be able to take him out one more time. Oh, he's scared now, because we're gonna kill him. We're gonna beat him. What are you doing, man? Oh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Oh no! We just gave him 8 M's. That's really bad, actually. <laughs> oh crap. I should have been smarter about that. Yeah, we got we got the bed, at least. That's good. <laughs> Surprise! Down here. Oh, he's trying our strat from the uh, the last game. Didn't work though. It's too bad. Oh, Gray has the emeralds. Hi, Gray. Yeah, he got four emeralds. He fell off into his own. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. All right, we're gonna outsmart this last gray guy. We're gonna get fireball and some TNT. We're gonna draw him out, and then proto his base when he doesn't expect it. Gonna be really, really good. Hey, okay, gray, I'm over here. What are you doing? Oh yes, yes. Fight me, fight me, fight me, fight me. Come on, come on. You won't. You won't. Come on. Come on, do it. You're not gonna do it. No! It didn't work! Oh, he got in the way. I thought it was gonna be so cool, but I messed up. Nice try, Bozo. Bozo? I do not appreciate being called that. Alright, well, I guess he's probably not gonna fall for it again, then. We're gonna have to change up our strategy a little bit. Come on, man, who are you calling a Bozo? We are going to hit him with something he... Whoops. Did not mean to do that. I meant to buy speed, whatever. Something he will never see coming. Nice try, bozo. Who you calling a bozo? All right. He didn't see that because we hurled. Isn't that so OP? All right. Well, if you like that little guide on how to use emeralds, um, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, unfortunately, I wasn't able to use very many emeralds um, in clutching situations because we didn't really lose our bed in any of those games. Well, that's not true. We, used, we lost our bed in one of those games. But I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you have any questions on when to use emeralds and why and how and all that, Leave it in the comments and I would be happy to answer any questions you have. Really, the better you get at emeralds, the harder it is to lose. Or I should say the easier it is to clutch or not lose your bed. There is one more thing, which is obsidian, which I'm probably not going to include that in the video because I think obsidian in solos is ridiculous. Um, you don't need obsidian. You should just be able to defend your bed or clutch. Otherwise, it takes too much time. <laughs> thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.